All right, what's up, guys? Uh, hey, thanks for clicking on this video. That was pretty cool of you. Um, so anyways, it's the weekend here, and I'm just bringing some stuff out, just to do a little shooting, and I figured I'd record it, and each one of these things has a, a reason to come out. Um, I just recently picked up this SIG P320. Um, nothing special, just a full size no cut just irons uh, so i've only got i think like 100 rounds through it so i just wanted to bring it out and get some more through it uh it's adam's gear solutions not my company different adam uh real real nice holster there cheap quick shipping and i mean quick but so if you're in the market check him out but anyways uh so i 3d printed the uh, handguard extension here and basically I just kind of wanted to see how that holds up uh, there's a couple companies that make them and um, kind of something I was just interested in just kind of wanted to see if I liked it first and uh, I'm still trying out the um, H HB Industries uh, short stroke buffer on this um, haven't shot it a ton since the last video about it so Figured I'd bring it out. Um, main reason I came out here today is I got this. Oh, I'd be sick if I wasn't in the light. Well, I'm gonna be. Um, the CMC uh, Combat Curve Trigger, two and a half pounds. Super, super, super light, super uh, short trigger. Um, just from dry firing it. It feels great, so I just wanted to bring it out and uh, give it a try, and yeah, so other than that, let's start shooting, I guess. If you're not, please subscribe. I'd really appreciate it. I'm trying to hit a 1,000, and it'll only happen if you do it, so yeah. Let's do some shooting, I suppose. Pretty nice day out here. I gotta get some chains for my targets there because they keep falling down. Everyone always comes over and shoots the chains, so but what can you do? All right, let's do it. Alrighty, I suppose uh, we'll start out the P320, put some shots through there and uh, see if it feels as good as it always does. I've shot a fair amount of these before, I just never owned a 320 and every time I shoot them pretty well, so yeah. Uh, I know I got a spare mag somewhere around here. sick if I could actually hit the slide release on there, huh? Let's fix that. Alright, oh. guy claims he shoots the 320 good, dumps two rounds out of it instantly, but I'm not re, I don't re-record this shit, so take it or leave it, I guess.
microphone should be good by now. Um, no surprise, it shoots fine. It's a big gun, easy to hold. Um, yeah, I mean they're just they're good guns. So if you're looking for one, I would, I'd recommend it. Um, I'm gonna shoot probably four or five more mags through it, and uh, I'll record it, but I'm not gonna include it unless something happens. So. Yeah, we'll uh, pick this up on one of these other guys here. Alrighty guys, um, 320 went fine, no issues at all. So now we'll do this dry bog. Um, kind of this video, I mean, I don't know. Like I said, I was just coming out here shooting, trying some stuff out that I have here and uh, figured I'd bring you guys along. So this is kind of a weird one. So they obviously make those handguard extensions. I think Arms Republic, I think, is one. And then uh, JT Industries, I think. Or JTAC. JTAC Industries. They make a, a pretty sick one that's got a QD and everything on it. But anyways, yeah, I just printed one and figured I'd bring it out and shoot it. We're still shooting with the HB Industries uh, short stroke buffer in there. So, yeah. Kind of just want to see what happens. Also, this is some uh, Reman... Uh, 115 so kind of just see if it likes it or not I haven't shot any remanufactured stuff I mean I shot plenty of steel through it and it was fine so yeah so let's uh, get a mag in and do a little bit of shooting with it oh, I think I'm most excited about is that CMC trigger in that BCM rifle there I'm not even kidding you, that thing was, felt real good when I was dry firing it. Ooh. Going from a light trigger to this guy. All right, hopefully the microphone's black, back, not black. Well, I guess it probably is, it's a black phone, so. Um, yeah, overall good. I mean, I'm not gonna say that was rapid firing, but that uh, 3D printed part feels fine, feels cool, so. Oh uh, yeah, I guess, uh, I'll throw this last round or this last mag in and get a little bit of slow motion video and uh, let you know if anything changes.
pretty. Uh, this dry bog was fine. No issues at all. Um, I just kind of want to show this trigger a little bit. I'm hoping this is in frame. Yeah, it probably should be. I just want to show you the pull and the reset on this. It is like nothing. There's like nothing there. This thing's awesome. Uh, so yeah. Show my dots on. My doggy. Hey doggy. <laughs> Alrighty. First shot through it. Let's see how it goes. Alrighty, so uh, it's definitely fast. I know I just said that probably in the last clip, but this thing could be ridiculously fast. I'll show you a little more. Fucking shooting in a swamp. Good and quick. Um, I'm going to tell you right now, I definitely recommend it. So, CMC is a pretty cool company, too. Their uh, last order I got from them, which was this trigger, they sent all, a bunch of NRA, uh, not NRA stuff, but the stuff from the NRA show in Texas there. So, they're just a pretty cool company. Um, so yeah, uh, I'm going to go ahead and do some more shooting out here and hopefully this little hangout and shoot video was cool. I mean, if you made it this far, I'll be surprised. If you did, leave it down below. Um, I can look at all the data and see who makes it there, but it's just, you never know. You never know if it's actually real. So <laughs> if you made it this far, leave it below. If you haven't, please like and subscribe. Uh, I'd really appreciate it. So, buy some guns, get gear, say no to politicians, and shoot the shit that you buy. Don't just let it sit around, that shit's stupid. But I know ammo is expensive, but eh, what can you do? I mean, you can sit around for 10 years and say that ammo is too expensive and then not shoot at all or just figure it out. So, I don't know. Alrighty, guys. Take care.